a treasure hunt. We're going on a treasure hunt. Got my sunglasses. Got my sunglasses. I'm not scared. Oh, look at those I'm grassy dunes. I'm not scared. Oh, look at those They're grassy so dunes. Tall. Can't go. They're so tall. We can't. It's a little short out. I think it could say Arizona. I'm not sure. It says National Park Area and Canada National Park. Do we have a Canuck in Alabama again? We could. I'll take that little shard and look at that. All right. All right, y'all. Y'all see that? Uh -huh. Beautiful blue marble. Yeah. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. I see a green one peeking out right there. seeing marbles or not but I don't because I, I usually don't find them and I love finding them all right that's a pretty one too yeah. all right all right check that out this is a toy airplane it's plastic but cool all right you know what? <clears throat> I need to get over on that side. Because, uh, I just seen another marble up here. Yeah. I'm going to get over on that side. I'm stuck over here right now. So, another cool marble. Alright. Alright, y'all check this out. I was just fixing the move over here. And I see this. I wonder if I can get it out. It's, it looks like it's stuck in that root. Alright, I'm going to have to put my gloves back on and see if I can get it out. I'll get back to you in a minute. Alright, y'all, I'm still trying to get this out, but I come across this. Sugar free check. I ain't never heard of that before. So I'm gonna take that home and look at it. It looks like an older Coke can. Alright, I'll take it back home, clean it up, and see. Okay, this might just have to stay in there because it, it's stuck in that root really hard and I'd tear it up. But it looks like it's a wagon made of wire stuff that's pretty cool though if i could get it out i'd take it but anyway i'm going over to that side where the marbles are all right see that okay that's a pretty neat looking bottle right there i think i'll take that one all right Uh, look at here. <coughs> Part of Captain is plastic though. Look kind of neat too. Alright. Check that one out. Pretty perfume bottle. Probably Avon. But that's a pretty one. Alright, I'll keep that one. Check that out. It's creepy. Mm. Okay. Okay, oh, what the heck is 
please. What is that? I'm gonna get it cleaned off good so I can see. Alright, looks like some kind of got a hole through it. Alright, I'm gonna get it cleaned off. Alright, now I'm gonna have to wait till I get home clean that up. I can't see it good. It looks like it says air brown. But, um, I'll get it cleaned up and get back to you. Alright. Alright, I'll check that out. <laughs> A little yellow skull. Alright. Cool. Alright, I'll take a look at that. It's a nice shape bottle. Looks like it might have some uh, uranium glass in it, too. Take that and get that clean. And I think there was a couple more in here. Oh, there's one right there. It ain't nothing. Alright. Alright, look at that, y'all. I think that might be a Carter belt. Cool. And, uh, I reckon I'm gonna have to go in a minute. So, I was cleaning off this little spot right in here. It's got a cloth in here. And, uh, but I'm gonna have to go in a minute, so... This might have to be continued. That's a telephone. Cool. Alright, y'all. See that? Alright, y'all. Look right here. My first coin out of here. I think it's a. I don't know. Penny? I'll have to get that cleaned up. I'm gonna get home and I'll get back to you. Alright, cool. Alright, <clears throat> me a little horn. <laughs> Alright. And I also found a, a spoon. So, and this right here, which doesn't, I don't know, if, it don't sound like it has anything in it, but, and, but we'll open it when I get home. Alright. Alright, that's it, y'all. See you back. Hey y'all, Jamie here from Country Diggers. I uh, went out for a little dig in the dump this morning and I will show you what I got. All right, we'll start with this 1950s shard. It's a souvenir plate or supposed to have been a souvenir plate from Arizona. It's got the Hopi Indian, the whole plate uh, um, has the Hopi Indian, uh, Roosevelt Dam, Flower uh, Yuma, uh, Meteor Crater, University of Arkansas, Arizona, and Cowboys. The whole plate is supposed to have all that on it. Um, I'll show you a picture of it, but um, that's pretty neat. And then I got these, this bottle right here, I thought that it might have some uh, uranium glass in it, because I don't know, that might have been just how the sun was shining on it or something, how the light was shining, but I don't know, uh, I don't know if it has any in it or not, I don't have a black light, so I can't tell, but um, that's a pretty shaped bottle. I've never found one like that before. And, uh, this one right here is a pretty shaped one, too. And I haven't, uh, that right there on the bottom, the bottom of it, never had one like that before. So that's kind of neat. And then I found this little perfume bottle, which is very pretty. Uh, I thought maybe Avon, it doesn't have a name on it. It has a, a number, I think, and I can't see it. But it's a pretty perfume bottle. 
really pretty. And I got this uh, cap gun, little, little cap gun. It's plastic, it's probably going in the trash because it's broken half. I would keep it if it was whole, but um, it's plastic and it's going in the trash. It's broke, but it's got a bull on it. And it's, it says um, made in Hong Kong on it, some right in there. I don't know if you can see it. Made in Hong Kong. And then this, it's a, what, uh, a little plastic USA B-10 bomber plane. What about that? That's neat. A B-10 bomber. But that's probably going in the garbage too because it's really messed up big time. And I got a spoon. It's just stainless steel. I got this right here, which is 1970s. I've never seen one like this before. Check. It says check. I've never heard of it before either. It's a 1970s. Uh, low calorie cola, sugar free check. I'm gonna see if I can get that cleaned up. Um, I'm not very good at cleaning cans and stuff. I most of the time punch holes in them when I'm cleaning them, but I'm gonna see if I can. And uh, this right here, I thought it was a garter clip, but now I'm not so sure. I, I don't know. That's probably going in the garbage too. It might be a curtain, something from a curtain or something like that. I don't know. And let's see what else. Oh yeah, I got the skull, <laughs> a yellow skull. Now, um, th these might be vowel caps for motorcycles and stuff. Because I, I looked it up and it's kind of like that. I don't know if it, that's exactly what that is or not, but anyway. And I got five beautiful marbles today. And uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, buttons. And a bead, a pretty green bead, and uh, that right there, a horn. <laughs> I'm throwing that away too. But, uh, and the penny, this is a penny, and it's 1969. It's a 1969 memorial. Um, That's the first coin that's come out of that dump. And then I got this, which is pretty cool, I think. It is, uh-oh, I drop stuff all the time. It is a, let's see. Let me see if y'all, see if I can get it over here and, uh, Get it in the light. It's a Anson L. Brown Inc. Columbus, Ohio. And on the back is a blood type A. And it's got RH positive down on bottom. I'm going to soak this in. Um, and some peroxide and maybe it'll come cleaner but anyway that it's a token it's a medical alert token from um anson l brown inc columbus ohio 
is from uh, 1947 to 1950. The company was uh, established in 1947 and um, dissolved in 1950. So that's between 47 and 50 right there. And that's pretty cool. All right, y'all, but that is it for today. And I will see y'all later. Have a great week. Bye.